Hello everybody and welcome to Take Scare Media. My name is Jared Lee and today it is a morning, nine o'clock. Heading over to Walmart. They have $5 steel books and we're gonna find out what they have. Let's take a look, maybe pick up a couple of them. Let's go. Right into Wally World we go. Oh, that's kind of cool. They got uh, Airwalk. I like it's really cool that Airwalk is coming back. I used to wear these shoes when I used to skate in the late 80s. That was my go-to shoe brand back in those days. Yep, same stuff over here. Nothing new yet, but well, let's see. They got five dollar books over here. So let's see, they got like five dollar ones here, and right here. And that one. So they got like steel books over here too. Uh, let's see here. Well, they got Mad Max. Check it out. Uh, let's see. Robin, Robin Hood, if you're into Robin Hood. I didn't really care for that one. But that's a steel book for sure. Nice. Oh, there's like a ton of them in here. I would have to dig. Hey, here's an Ash. I didn't even see the first season of that one. Hmm. I haven't even seen that yet either. Well, I'm going to dig through here and see what I can All find. Right, so... They probably have something at the bottom of it, but I don't have time to spend it. But they do have a couple over here. Let's see what they have over here. Oh, they got Moonfall. Look at this. Yeah, they got Blu-ray for Moonfall. Yeah. I don't worry. I didn't care for that movie, actually. But if you liked it, it's, uh, I guess, I don't know. I don't really care for it. It was weird. I mean, it started out okay. Oh, look. Hitman's wife, and then the other one is gone now. What's this one? Hunger Games. Nobody cares about that. <laughs> Three from Hell. I didn't really care for that one. I mean, that would be kind of cool to have, but I don't know. I, I, I'd rather have uh, uh, Devil's Rejects on Steelbook if I could find that. Maybe House of Thousand Corpses. Let's see if they got anything over here. Already got that one. Hmm. I saw online there was this Exorcist Steelbook that came out a while ago and it looks so nice, but ugh, those are hard to find now. Uh, I was still looking for Fright Night and Maxima Overdrive on Steelbook. That's what I like to find. All right, well, we're the Disney section, of course. You got the Blu-rays, steelbooks for the shows. Uh, Mandalorian 1 was good, but the rest, WandaVision was okay. That new Indiana Jones was stupid. The only one up here I would actually get is Nightmare Steelbook. I actually wouldn't mind getting that. Um, but that's not a steel. Is that a steelbook? Uh, I don't know. You know that, that's just a collector's box. But I probably, if that was a steel book, I probably would definitely would get it. Here's this Winnie the Pooh thing again. I haven't seen the new Ghostbusters yet, but I'm probably going to go see it this week. And yet, to pick up Friday 13th, so I got to get those. I got the Chuckies. I have them from Nightmares. I need to get all my icons. But eventually, and as you saw my video, or whole video I got from uh, Review Spot, I have a few of the, um, few of the uh, Halloween movies. Eventually, I'd like to try to find a, uh, a set of them, like a really cool um, set of those. But until then, that'd be cool. Um, it's cool to have what I have now. You know, this is fun. I love the, I love collecting this because it's uh, stuff that I like and not just randomly buying. Like this over here. This is the new Fright Night, the new Earth Fright Night, the remake. I didn't care for it. And then they actually have Fright Night 2 remake and didn't care for it. I'd rather have Fright Night on Steelbook in Fright Night Part 2 if I can find it. It's a hard one to find right now. 
But man, Fright Night Part 2, let me know if you found it somewhere. I'll, I'll definitely like to go and find it and get it. I'll look John Wick and Blu-ray, but I got those in Steelbook Blu-rays. Awesome. Anyway, I went to my hiding spot. I have a few here. I'll definitely show you in a little bit. Looking forward to this week. Hopefully there's some new ones coming out this week. So stay tuned. I'm going to make another trip on Tuesday um, for sure over here. And let's see if anything's changed on there. I'm still looking at that 4K version of um, Texas Chainsaw. Maybe. I don't have a 4K player, but hey, I buy it just to have it. So that way when I do get a 4K, I can watch it. Plus it's a classic movie. Classic movie. So I may be picking that up this week on Tuesday. So stay tuned. All right. With that said, I'm going to head out. I'm going to probably go get some donuts or something. And uh, I'll show you what I got in a second. All right, everybody. I am uh, out of Walmart. So here's what we got. Here's what we got. So I found a few, uh, just three of them. I don't know what else is more in that um, $5 bin. Because there's probably more deep down. I wish everything was out. Um, like my hometown, they have everything out where you don't have to dig, but here you have to dig. But anyway, I'm, I am going to go look at other Walmarts too in uh, future videos. But right now, it's my Walmart next, next to me. First up, this is pure 80s cheese, pure 80s awesomeness. And, you know, you, <laughs> I couldn't pass this up. Total Recall, Blue Ray. 4k and blu-ray yep 4k blu-ray steel book with a slip cover this probably was pretty good uh when it was in best buy as far as i can tell some of the slip covers are a little bit wonky but so we're gonna get i guess five dollars and they're gonna be in the bin they're gonna be moved around a lot hopefully the steel book's okay it looks like it is <laughs> Boom, Terminator 2, that's right, Terminator 2, I, don't, I haven't got Terminator yet, but I will find that one, but you definitely would look, I have to have Terminator 2, because this is an awesome sequel, stand alone on its own, it don't, you don't even need the first one, but I do want to get the first one, um, and it looks like this is uh, first pressing too, on, on the side I could tell, it says first pressing or something like that, I'll find out when I open it. I will be doing um, unboxings for each one of these and the ones I have at home as well. We got the first saw. The first saw in the Blu-ray and 4K. Um, 4K Ultra Disc Blu-ray movie. Movie and special feature. It is the unrated version. Unrated. I'm not sure what that means. I haven't... I haven't seen the unrated version. I think I've only seen the uh, rated version or the one that was out in the theater. So I'm interested in seeing the unrated version of this. Um, again, I will be doing an unboxing for each one of these guys. So stay tuned for that. I have more at home John Wick movies to do. All right, so stay tuned. Um, please follow me. Hit that like button. Hit that notification Make sure you get that done because I will be coming out with these videos, unboxing these bad boys, and uh, looking forward to see you in the comments. And until next time, everybody, I'm Jared Lee. This is Take Scare Media. And thumbs me up, comment down below, subscribe for more videos on the way, and as always, remember to take scare. <laughs>